is for D Gates. D as in David. Come on. We are at the airport. Obviously still in the midst of everything. Yeah. How are you feeling? Uh, okay. Uh, okay. Uh, Please hold on. Uh, this train is departing. It's like 45 minutes. Almost gone. We got another wing seat. It is pouring already in Florida. Welcome back home, babe. Good to be home. The only thing is not quite home. The pups aren't here. So I gotta go rescue Zoe from the clutches of Finley and Marley. Apparently Finley and Marley are now ganging up on Zoe. A whole mess right now. And then we gotta go pick up Diesel. And then later today, huh? You have a surprise guest. Yeah, later today we have a surprise guest coming for a couple days. We gotta wait for her to get here. Oh, you're just gonna be what? Half of a human, a human race, a male or a female. All right, I gotta go. I'm gonna go rescue Zoe and Marley. Actually, I should say I'm gonna go rescue Zoe. Oh hi! Oh big boy! Oh, oh boy! Finn. Marley, <laughs> hi Finn. Okay. Well, that's right. Come on, sit down. Hi! Holy crap! Oh my god! Hi! What do you got? Hi, Mar. What do you got, Zoe? No. Hi. No. Oh, hi, Mar. Hi. Hi. Hi, hi Finn. He's coming. Oh, he's coming for me. Hi. Oh. He's a monster. <laughs> hey, twerps. Hey, Mar. Hey, Zoe. I missed you, dudes. <laughs> Zoe, you hanging out? As you can see, Marley got super freaking tired the second I got there. You cool back there? You cool? What are you doing? Hey, Zo. Well, guess what happened today? They lost my guitar. I don't know what it is about my bass. They just, everyone seems to just want to lose my bass. I don't know. And they lost our other two bags of luggage, like our clothes. Oh, and they broke what was called an X32. It's our like monitor system. So we can like change things in our ear. They broke that. So we kind of had to deal with that a little bit at the airport. If you guys were confused about the whole like filming and like the attempt one, attempt two, attempt three thing, what was going on is there was so much lightning that we could not land the airplane like they went to go and they were like nope can't do it and then they would take off again and then they would circle I think they circled and tried to land three times on so the third attempt they did it as you can probably see Allie was freaking out Allie does not do really well with flying she gets really like petrified so I'm always trying to calm her down like especially in turbulence I always try to explain if anyone gets kind of scared with flying in turbulence think of it this is how I always explain it think of it as a bumpy road you can never go down a road and it's smooth. If you think about it, you're going 500 plus miles an hour through air, there's always gonna be some bumps. Like right now, they're driving the road right now and there's bumps, so it's like turbulence. So I always try to explain that to her and I think it helps. And hopefully if you guys are flying and you get scared as well, hopefully that helps as well. But I will have to admit, 
this one was a little rougher because like going down and trying to land and then the pilot going, oh, nope, we can't land. Don't worry, we have enough fuel. If we have to divert to Orlando, we will, but we should have enough fuel. <laughs> Saying we should have enough fuel is not gonna reassure three or 400 people on an airplane, especially when Ali's freaking out, that one person right there. At any rate, we landed, we're back at home. Our bag should be getting delivered. Hopefully my base doesn't get lost again. We don't have any shows in the next couple of days, so I'm not too worried. We do have a road trip Allie and I are gonna be taking to Tennessee in the next couple of days. So as long as it gets delivered before then, that I'll be cool with it. That's a good idea there, Zoe. Let's do this. I'll be right back. Come on, just a little bit. Can I sleep a little bit? Hey. <laughs> Don't wake me up. Don't you step on me or wake me up. You know what Marley's ears remind me of? Like, was it aliens where they go up when they want to hear some? Like, food? Hey, cookie? <laughs> what are you doing? What's wrong with your foot? <laughs> Once you see Marley's ears do that, you can't unsee it. Right, Mar? Ready? No, can you hear me, Mar? I just cleaned. I put this Butt. <laughs> Lily, thank you for being good. You got walker shoes. I know she can never lay normal. <laughs> I have no idea what time it is right now. What it's time like is it? Four. It's four? Yeah. My we body feels like it's midnight. Did you tell them we have one of their plane houses? Oh yeah. Allie thought lot. the plane was gonna fall out of the sky. I already told them. God, I thought the plane it was very scary. I don't I have I know I probably look like an absolute thing. No, idiot, I explained how it's kind of like the bumps in our road and stuff. Yeah, but even just that just makes me so uneasy. Like, I, it is really, that's like probably one of my biggest fears. I'm like really discovering is that just like turbulence. It sounds strange, but like turbulence in the sky. Yeah. Like, like really just like going down the sky is a scary thing for me. And, and maybe that seems like a little crazy, a little um, extreme. No, no, it's. It just, my heart just it's sinks. Okay every single time so I'm so scared. No, you're okay. I'm going to bed. <coughs> but I don't want to get up. <coughs> I don't want to. No. Don't bug her. Don't. She's not going to do anything. <laughs> Such a dick. Well, you could be in a dick. <laughs> you guys remember I was saying we had a special guest? Let me turn the light on. The big, re oh. Oh, 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 <laughs> the big go, reveal. Go, the big Hi. reveal. And we meet again. Yes. Me. This is Olga's first time in Th St. Yes. Petersburg, right? Yeah. And of course, Allie, where are we going? I'm going to say, I'm going to say, yeah. Avenue. There we go. Avenue. As you know, every time we go, we're like the unofficial spokespeople, I think, for that. Every time anyone comes, <laughs> Allie must take them to the avenue. So that's what we're gonna do. I'll run at her. Mother hey! <laughs> we got you. <laughs> and Allie. <laughs> hey! <laughs> Where are you going? Mother First off, let's just address the thing on Allie's head. I just took a shower. Second off, I just want to say goodnight. It is so awesome to be home. I'm so jet lagged, but I'm just so happy to be with these little twerps. It was funny. I came home. Look at them. I know. They're all passing out, hanging out. I didn't sleep at all on the plane, maybe like 20 minutes, and then we had that awful experience with the turbulence. The, the three attempts and I'm to sorry try to I felt land. like an idiot, but I just. I feel like a lot of people have that issue, though. Before we go to bed, I just wanted to say we had so much fun in Hawaii. I hope you guys had fun as well on kind of it's like a vir virtual vacation for you guys. We just wanted to do like right now, just a couple clips of our, some of our favorite moments from Hawaii. So let's just go into that right now.
Those are some of the moments that I will never forget. This was honestly one of the best trips I've ever had. Of all those clips, which one was your favorite? Mine was definitely shark diving. I loved shark diving. I loved it, but I think driving the coast was like pretty magical for that me. That was pretty cool too. Just because like I just, I love nature and I sound so corny right now, but I told Charles there was a point during the drive where I got like really teary eyed and super emotional. The color. She actually did. But it, it's beautiful. It was like, incredible because you don't see it. And it's just the land and then like the appreciation for the land that the people have. But literally, I think I said it a couple times, it was like bringing up the saturation and just cranking it. Kind of like this but not that ugly. But you know, it's like even the depth of like how far back like the it, mountains were. And you like, know what kind of blew like my the mind? the water, like how the deep water the water blew got. My mind. And then the fish, like I saw, I remember telling you, remember, I went down and I saw this fish, literally every single color you could ever imagine. No, we did this a couple days ago, but now the officially the Hawaii trip is over. What was your favorite moment of watching these videos from the Hawaii trip, from your virtual Hawaii trip? And what I just realized, you know, like where I always make the comparison <laughs> of like, you know, not every day guys can we go swim with sharks or punch a shark in the face or do something like that. I cannot anymore say that ever again because we now have literally done that. Also one of my favorite moments is like being able to share it with our friends because a lot of times like you have to share it privately. We can take photos, but nobody really understands like what we saw or what right. we felt. It brought smiles to every single person that we were with. It was really kind of a cool thing too, because everybody experienced it the same, but experienced it different. And on that note, guys, I want to say good night, and I will see you tomorrow as always. Have a great night. If you yeah. did miss the Hawaii vlogs, go check them out. I will put a link down in the description of the last few mm -hmm. days. Have a good night, guys. <laughs>